my name is Brooke and welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a haul of the various things that I have gotten throughout the month of January. Um, I definitely did do a little bit of spending on some things that I saw that I quite wanted uh, clothing and stuff wise so you guys are going to see that. Almost everything I bought I got on either clearance or a really good sale and honestly I am so excited about it. The stuff you're going to see today is from Airy, American Eagle, Urban Planet, and a store called Pink Sunday Studio um, where I got a Disney item. I ordered all this stuff throughout January so this is just the collective pile of it. I have worn all of it already actually and this is just me showing it to you so I do classify this a mid-size try-on haul since I am approximately a size 810 in clothing sizes depending on the store so I will also tell you guys what sizes I got in everything and try to link everything down below if you guys do want to get it for yourselves some of this stuff was on clearance so I'm not sure if it's still available um, but I'll try my best so the first pile of things I will show you are from Airy this is definitely where I got the most stuff and honestly I love Airy's clothes so much since March, I have just been obsessed with Aries clothes, their loungewear, their leggings, their workout clothes, their pajamas, like all of it is so good and so comfy. I love it so much. I have honestly just been absolutely obsessed. So the first thing I'll show you is a pair of pajama shorts. Um, this is what they look like here. They have this checkerboard and cheetah print pattern kind of mixed in on them. Um, they're really cute. I got these in a size large. Normally I am a medium in Aerie bottoms, but I decided to get a large because because I do like my pajamas a little bit oversized. They're a lot more comfy that way I find. So I got these in a large, they fit me great. Um, I really do enjoy them. I next got two pairs of leggings and these are the offline OG leggings. And I got one in a maroon color and then I got another pair in regular black. They are a little bit tight on my calves and they are a little bit loose in my back. Like. You know how sometimes pants will like fit in the front and then be really loose at the back? Um, at the waist, that's kind of the deal I'm working with. So they do slide down a bit. However, they really weren't that expensive. I think I paid like $14.99 for them. And they are really good quality. Um, however, they also do collect a lot of pet hair. So these are going to be great for wearing around the house and just lounging around here. I'm not sure how much I will actually wear them to like an outing because they do slide down a little bit because they are a little big in the waist. Um, but just wearing them lounging around the house and that absolutely perfect this is my first ever pair of leggings in a color other than black and I went with something really neutral really dark still to kind of get myself used to it but I really do enjoy it and I think I will be getting more of the colored leggings in the future and both of the leggings I did get in a size medium this is then a three-quarter zip which is actually my favorite thing to pair with the maroon leggings because they are a darker color um, it's great to pair with this which is gray black and white white and um, it has a pattern on it so those are solid with a color and this is black and white with a pattern which I love um, this is a three-quarter zip I got this in a size small since it is very oversized and I'm glad I did get in a size small because it even looks oversized on me um, so cute one of if not my new favorite shirt I love it so much it's so comfortable and I don't know maybe this is just like a me issue but with a lot of hoodies and stuff I have an issue where the back of my hair gets really really knotted in like the hoodie and like higher neck part of shirts like this but in this one it doesn't happen I don't know why it doesn't happen but it just doesn't it's really comfortable the zipper is great I usually have it like zipped down a bit when I'm wearing it like this and it's just super comfy. They have, I know they have this one in this color still, and then they have another one in more of like a brown cheetah printy pattern as well. And then the final three pieces I got from Airy are actually a set. So this is technically a pajama set, but I'm just wearing it around the house as a loungewear set because it is super cozy and comfortable, and I cannot wear long sleeves to bed. But it is a super fuzzy pajama set or lounge set as I will be wearing it. The cheetah print itself, it's very green and then there is a blue in the middle which I find is just a really great combination. I love how it looks on me. It's that darker color. I love wearing darker colors. Um, I think it's really cute and then it comes with a pair of shorts in the exact same pattern, exact same material. The shorts have pockets um, which is lovely for carrying like my phone in that around the house. These are so cute. I love this set so so much. Um, I got the bottoms in a medium and I got the top once again in a size small since it was supposed to be oversized and these fit me perfectly um, wonderfully great and of course I had to get the matching scrunchie to go with it it's literally the same pattern same material 
I love wearing all of these together around the house. Like, it is such a lazy day outfit, but I also feel so put together wearing it. Honestly, just my absolute favorite. I love it. Next up, American Eagle. And at American Eagle, which is basically airy, let's be honest, I got a cardigan. I got this in a size medium, and they had so many colors to choose from, but of course, I had to choose the teal color. It is a adorable cardigan. Adorable. It is so fuzzy and warm. It's a knit material, obviously, and and it is just so, so cute. The sleeves are kind of bubbly, I guess you could call it, which is my favorite type of sleeve to wear in a sweater. And I adore this so much. Um, on my cardigans, I either wear underneath like a tube top or a bralette or something. It's just like really cute and simplistic, but it's also really, really comfortable to just lazy around the house. Love this so much. Next, we can talk about Pink Sunday Studio. This is a small shop that sells a lot of pop culture inspired merchandise. Not spawn, no codes, no nothing if they want to and are watching this. I would love to because I love this sweater, but but um, no, it's, this is not sponsored. Um, so I got this sweater. <sighs> I love this sweater so much. You know, I said the other one was my new favorite piece of clothing. No, this here is my new favorite piece of clothing. This is a pastel blue sweater. Um, I got it in a size large. It is oversized on me, but that's totally okay. Um, it is a pastel blue sweater that is embroidered, and on the embroidery, it says, Do As Dreamers Do Club, established in 2003, which is a reference to the Wishes fireworks in Walt Disney World, which I absolutely adore. Stuff like this is so nice to me because it is so cute. It is so, so cute, and it is Disney, but not in your face Disney. It's a very, very subtle type of Disney. Like, literally, I'm considering ordering another one. They have one in white that has, like, a different words on it and one in like a pastel pink that also has different words on it I'm literally considering ordering another one because I'm like I will wear this everywhere like literally everywhere this arrived at my house within four weeks whereas some small shops I've literally had to wait like four months for things to arrive here in Canada this came so quick I was so happy about it next on to Urban Planet everything I got at Urban Planet was six dollars which made me super happy there was a huge sale on 50% um, off everything regular these things are each $11.99 but I got them for $5.99 actually. So super good prices and uh, I'll show you what I got. So first off I got this tumbler mug. I know this isn't clothing but I definitely wanted to include it because it is a beautiful pastel purple. Like it is so gorgeous and nice. I've been putting water in here actually and just keeping it in my room. However, oh, it's so great. It's like a very soft outer coating too. Like it doesn't feel like plastic plastic. It's more like a very soft velvety almost plastic if that makes sense um it's really cute it's really big the straw even matches like it's such a nice little container to keep water in and it just it's so aesthetic in itself i love it only six dollars i then got this t-shirt i got this in a extra large and it just says on the front always be kind i thought that was really cute a very light pink color um i thought it'd be really cute to wear in the spring honestly like i don't know i just picture me like planting a garden or something wearing this shirt and be like always be kind and planting flowers and like all this spring weathery stuff um, which probably actually wouldn't be a good choice because it is light pink and gardens are dirty but that is what I picture with this shirt it's really adorable it's oversized on me it's like it's just a nice cotton material it's really comfortable um, yeah and then the final item um, so like I said I've been wearing this stuff and I really haven't been able to find the rest of this item. They're somewhere like in the wash or in my closet or something. Um, but I got a three pack of Mickey Mouse socks and I can only find one sock, but there were three different pairs and they were all a little different. So one was Mickey like slipping on a banana peel. One is like just red and white Mickey. And then this one is a black pair with a bunch of little Mickey heads on it. This pair is honestly my favorite anyway. Um, but I got the three pairs for $6 always love me some good Disney socks. And that is a haul of things I got in January because I was sad I could not leave my house. Um, so yeah, I hope you did enjoy this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Go check out my channel and subscribe if you haven't already. I post new videos all the time. So thank you again so much for watching and I hope you have a magical rest of your day.